So I did promise another um, short Nightmare on Elm Street card, a uh, Freddy Krueger card. We are going to use, let's see here, um, I think we're going to use this red here. I don't know what the color is. It says number 35. And then um, we are just, whoa, baby. We are just going to, I have this large, um, this large rubber stamp <laughs> from Hero Arts. Um, I don't know if my plan here is going to work. Um, I just thought I would paint on the, uh, I don't know. This is, uh, this kind of looks like it's not working. Um, paint on some red for the stripes. So, and then I thought we would color it in with the green. So let's just see kind of how it works and if it works at all, that is. Hot mess. Okay, that's what that is. Um, let me find paper towel. All right, first of all, it's definitely not red enough. Okay. Yeah, not red enough. All right, so let me wipe this off. So, okay, that's a fail. Let's just try to use the other side. Let's see what we think about that. It was up a little bit. Um, all right, so this time let's use this fired brick distress ink. All right, well, that's going to look better. And then maybe we can just watercolor in the middle. We'll see. All right, let's try that. I wonder if it's too, uh, too wet or anything. All right, so let's try to do a little more down here. A couple of specks up there. Press really hard. So this is um, just another horror-themed movie card. Um, that, oh, <laughs> I can't do it with that end. Um, let's just take the ink pad and kind of swipe that. Um, this, I think the bottom row is the problem area. All right, so let's just fill in that area with the ink pad a little bit too and call it good. All right. So let's see what we can do with this. Let me move all this stuff out of the way, wipe this off a little bit. So it's not such a complete mess. We'll see how it goes. Because I actually need the Misty once again in a minute for, for this other part. I believe anyway. We will see how it goes. Okay, so now let's go ahead and get our watercolors back out. Can you see that? Yes. Okay. Um, so we're just going to find a nice little sort of olive green, I guess. Um, and maybe this will be almost the size of that. And we can just get a nice strip going down there. It's not going to matter if it's a little... Um, it's a little, you know, I don't, I don't want it to be perfect. I don't feel like Freddie's um, red and green sweater stripe is perfect anyway. So, and plus it's like torn and it's got blood all over it. And so it's all good. All right. So this is working out. Okay. This is not watercolor paper, by the way. Um, probably should have used that looking back, but that's okay. We can just kind of fill in a few little spots here and there that are open with, with the green. Okay. So let me try to, to 
just dab this back off so it will dry a little bit faster. Okay. Um, I think that will work. We're not going to worry about this in. I think I'm just going to trim that off, honestly. Um, it was just going to kind of be some sort of layer anyway. Um, so we'll just kind of see what we come up with. So I put out Elm Street, a dream ticket, a little die cut um, lantern. So let's see what we have here. Uh, I went ahead and cut some of these in case that, that wasn't working, but I think we'll just call it okay. Um, I really do want to trim that off. I really don't want to get my trimmer out, so let's just see if we can do it like this. I normally can't cut very straight, but, um, yeah, you know. This could be a little bit darker, I feel like. Um, I don't know. We'll see. So, we could use this, Never Sleep Again. Um, we could use this. Um, so we could write, I don't know, let's see what we, we plan to use here. That would work, or this would work as well. Um, we definitely need some blood splatter or something going on like that here. Um, I have all these little things, but I don't think any of that's blood splatter. So... We could almost have the um, the background be sort of an outline and do it this way as well. I almost like that better. Um, or we could do it this way. I know, guys. Sorry, I'm <laughs> when I haven't planned it out. You can really tell, right? But um, this is kind of the, the creative process. Uh, that almost looks like a circus theme, though. It's not, I don't know about that. But if we blood splattered that up, because our, our little image that we're going to stamp is kind of long. So I think that's, uh, let's go around the edges. We'll do that. Some red that'll that'll help a little bit, and then I'll find some blood splatter or something soon. I feel like the stripes are supposed to go this way, um, but our image is sort of long. So let's just take him off there and see about how long he is. Yeah, he's kind of long there. So, and he's actually, if we use this, he's going to have to go up even more. So, well, he can go normal, I guess, and that'll just cover his feet. I think that will be what happens. Okay, so let's go ahead and stamp him, because I know I want to do that. Um, so, I asked you guys in the last Nightmare on Elm Street card if, uh, hmm, I guess I'll just center him, but how am I going to get that Elm Street on there? Let's bring him on down a little bit and over, in case I want to add that. Okay, that's what we'll do. Um, and this is also, I don't know if I said this otherwise, but this is a stamp boutique um, stamp. And he just looks like Freddy with his fingers there. I wish I had like a little brown hat or a little fedora kind of hat to put on there, but I don't. So, we'll stamp him again. Hmm. 
Okay, I really enjoy doing this whole horror movie um, card series. There is a playlist if you have missed any of them. They will all be in the playlist, so no worries. can check them out in years to come. Woohoo! Um, Alright, so I'm going to slide this down and... I'm going to look for some green ink. Alright. Hang on, guys. I have to get up for that. I will be right back. Just trying to find kind of a darker some sort of dark green. Okay, I've got it. Sorry about that, guys. So, okay. So we have any of these, but I think we're going to try this one first. All right. So... I feel like we need to do something to the edges of all of these and it can just be, it can be all over, it can be around. You don't have to do it in any particular way, I don't think. And uh, we'll put a little bit of texture somewhere. Here and there. Um, and actually, I'll tell you what, we'll use, we can use some of this block here. Um, this is also a stamp boutique block. Um, maybe we can use those crosses or little plus signs. I don't know which they are. Um, add a little something to this cross there. That one. Okay. I'll move that out. I wonder if we should also have this one like creeping up behind. Nah, not, I don't believe. Um, okay, so now we are going to write Fred Krueger. I'm going to try to squeeze that in. Um, maybe just a rest in peace. And, I don't know. We'll see. Um, we'll probably have to cut that off anyway, so it's not going to matter there on the end. Let's go ahead and look at that. So let's take this up. Luckily, it does not seem too wet. Um, so have you guys been watching anything good on, uh, on TV this week? I've been watching that the Food Channel. Um, yesterday they did the like this creepy clown challenge. That was pretty cool. Um, so like I don't know if it's called Bake Off or I don't know what it's called, but it's on the Food Channel, and uh, I think it's pretty fun. So I enjoyed that. Um, I got some now. I want to do like a creepy clown party. So uh, that might be coming up in one of the, the following years to come how that goes. All right. I love, um, you know, how they sing the song. One, two, Freddy's coming for you. Three, four, lock your door. Five, six, get a crucifix. Seven, eight, stay, better stay up late. Nine, ten, that's where this comes from. Nine, ten, you'll never sleep again. And it's in this, like, creepy voice, the whole song. So, I love that. Um, but... All right, so we'll kind of do it down here, I think, in this corner. So, yeah, take that up. Okay. Um, all right, so what do you guys think? I'm almost thinking the green. I don't know. I'm not, I cannot decide. This may be red. Maybe red with some green whatever around it, like um, the little, you know, 
distressing it or whatever. I think I like that okay. It just, it seems a little too red with the poppy red there, you know. Anyway, I do have one confession to make that I feel like the Halloween people may, like, throw me under the bus and, you know, I don't know, give me lashings or something. Um, my uncle called last night, and uh, I should have been in here crafting, but I wasn't. And he was like, what are you doing? I'm like, oh, nothing. And um, he said, well... He was actually looking for my father, but um, anyway, we started talking, and then he's like, oh, I'll turn it on the Hallmark Channel, and so I did. He's like, this is my favorite Christmas movie ever. <laughs> I'm like, Christmas? I can, you cannot watch Christmas, Neil. It's like, no, absolutely not. No, no, and um, so anyway, he's like, no, no, seriously, this one's really, really good, and I'm like, hey, you cannot watch Christmas before Halloween. It's just, you can't do it. And especially me, like the Halloween nut. And uh, so he's like, I promise you'll love it, you'll love it. And anyway, so I ended up watching it. And um, and it was awesome. It was called, I think it was The Christmas Card or something like that. And it was such a good movie. And so I sent him a text back that he was right and blah, blah, blah. And he's like, I'm watching another one. And he told me what that was called. I'm like, oh, no, no more. One is my limit. Um, so... But I cannot believe, as much as I raised Cain about that, that I actually watched one before Christmas. Um, or before Halloween, I mean. Um, Alright, so I'm going to do that there. Yes, that is that is the spot. Okay. <laughs> um, and then I will stamp Elm right there in the middle. Once it's a little more dry. Um, but anyway, there are not as many Halloween movies on, um, this weekend as I thought there would be. I was hoping that there would be. There's still the same ones, like Practical Magic, um, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, things like that. You know, that is one movie that I have never, ever watched, is the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I don't know why, like, I always meant to, but I've watched pieces of it. It'll be on, or there'll be, like, part whatever, three or something, um, so I'm going to use this dream ticket as well, but we're going to green it up just a little bit. Um, so tell me if you guys like, like that, and if it's worth um, watching this year, I will try and squeeze it in. Honestly, I'm kind of running behind on everything, um, as usual. <laughs> I don't know what happens to the month of Halloween. Do you guys, like, it's just, it just flies by, and it kills me. Like, there's so many things I want to do, but... Just can't squeeze them all in. Um, so, uh, I don't know. But anyway, um, and no other month seems to do that. I mean, like, the holidays, you know, rush and things. But it's just still, it's not like this month. Maybe it's because I just like this month the best. Um, so, I'm going to do, I'm going to stamp E. L. I was going to put Elm Street, but it would really be um, squeezing it in there too much, I feel like. So I'm just going to do Elm. And this is the, by the way, the worst little set of, uh, this is probably just like a buck. But yeah, it is Studio G. Probably came from Michael's. They're all hooked together and they pull apart and the bottoms come off. And I would not recommend those at all, but it's, it's doing the job. So whatever. Um, okay, so now what else could we do here? We need to color him in a little bit. Um, I think I'm going to color. It's going to take a little while, but I'm going to color all these little squares in. And then we'll do the stripes on his coat um, in, in a green. So they had a, uh, a haunted house at my school last night, well actually two nights, um, Friday and Saturday, and the kids were really looking forward to that. I was pretty, um, I was going to go, but I didn't. I changed my mind. It has been pouring, pouring, pouring the rain, and um, and of course today it's bright, and, well not bright and sunny, but it's bright anyway. Um, it's dry, but um, so I had a wet, soggy night, and I already had to go out to go to the store, and I was that was earlier, and 
I don't know. Honestly, I just got back in. I'd ordered a pizza, and um, we have a new pizza place here in town, and so I tried it, and uh, it was pretty good, and um, so definitely we'll be going back there, but um, uh, what was I saying? Oh, anyway, the haunted house, so I didn't go back out, but I know my kiddos, especially my 8th graders, will be disappointed because they were telling me all about it on Friday and what, you know, some of them are going to be in it and some are just coming, but, um, so I was hoping to go just to kind of support them, but I don't know, I just got in and got lazy and tired and it was warm in here, it was wet out there, and so that's just kind of where that ended, unfortunately. But um, there have been lots of haunted houses um, all over our area lately, so um, that's not the only one, of course, but um, but I did want to try to make it to that one. But anyway, um, so Monday, I've got to uh, actually sometime today do my boyfriend a card because his, his birthday is this Monday. I think I'm coloring the wrong thing. All right. Um... So I may uh, film that one as well. Don't know yet, but we will see. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and give him some red legs and then maybe some green um, something there. All right, let me find a green. I had a green marker, there it is. It kinda matched that. But you can't see it if I do it matte color, so let's try this a little bit brighter green. Freddie can just pretend he's uh, brightening himself up with this green. Did I see that? Okay. I don't think it really matters, but... I like to stick with the whole green and red stripes. All right. Just go ahead and give him green kind of knifey hands there. I'll just color this green for time's sake. And let's see. Um, but yeah, last last weekend, Hallmark Channel had the Good Witch on, and I get that, like all weekend, because it's almost Halloween, hello, but so why, why Christmas now? I don't understand, but anyway, I'll get off that kick. Okay, so let's go ahead and give him some red eyes, some little red teeth, maybe even some little red pieces of hair, even though I know he doesn't really have red hair. I guess his hair was like burnt off. He didn't have any hair at all, so. Um, okay. So there's that. Um, trying to think of something we can do to kind of liven it up. I have I have these things that's that are spelled out. I've spelled out Freddy and Elm Street. Um, let's, I guess we could do old Freddy. I don't know. Alright, E, D, Y, I need another D, another R, and F. Alright. Alright, we could spell out Freddy. I don't know. I don't think I really like that. I'm not sure. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know if I like that. I do think this needs some red around it. Or maybe it needs black. Um, let's see. So let me find some blood splatters. Um, all right, so I've got a big large one. Probably just do this little one again. Oh, this was what I was going to do, darn it. Ah, poop. That's what was going to help it. I wonder if I can peel this up. 
without too much damage. I think I can. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. I like this better. All right. So let's go ahead and... Here's my glue. Let's go ahead and kind of glue this all up. And that will help. All right. I think, yeah, that's... I knew I was thinking of something else, and it had something else on it. Sometimes things, like, right in front of you just get lost. So... Okay, so I will just trim this part off. Scissors a little gluey, but that's okay. Okay, so now let's see if we can stick this up here. All right, I like that better anyway. I hope that'll stick second time around okay I like that better all right so now I feel better about it <laughs> so um, let's kind of just oh I was gonna do blood splatter all right so this is not my favorite ink to do blood splatter with but it'll be all right I guess Definitely need some splatter coming down from the nails. Okay, one more maybe right there. All right, I'm feeling better about it. We could put some blood splatter on here. Blood splatter right there. All right, blood helps everything. Look at that. Now it's starting to look like a real card, hot diggity dog. Okay, um... So, what can I highlight now? I um, guess I could highlight his... Do you think I could highlight his nails a little? Or his... I don't know. I want to highlight something. Um, hmm. I don't know. I guess nothing. Okay. So, I did just a tiny bit right there. Can you see on the nails how it'll shimmer just a little bit now? Okay. All right, guys, so that is Freddy Part 2. We'll call it that. <laughs> All right, guys, talk to you later. Bye.